Why Islam Strictly Prohibits the Homosexual Act Part 2 One day, there were two travelers that needed a place to stay. These travelers happened to come to the town of Prophet Lut, the first to see these travelers was one of Prophet Lut's daughters. She saw how beautiful these young men were. She immediately called her father and told him about the handsome-looking travelers that came to town. Prophet Lut tried to hint at the travelers to leave the town, but they refused. Prophet Lut finally decided to let them come inside his home. Prophet Lut's wife sneaked out of the house in order to inform the people of the handsome travelers. Prophet Lut's wife was also a matchmaker for the men. It says in Surah Taramaya 10. Allah says. Allah presents an example of those who disbelieved, the wife of Noah and the wife of Lot. They were under two of our righteous servants but betrayed them, so those prophets did not avail them from Allah at all, and it was said, Enter the fire with those who enter. Surah at Tarim 66 colon 10. The men of the town came to Prophet Lut house and they started banging on the front door. They demanded to come and see the travelers. Imagine the situation that Prophet Lut was going through. He pleaded with his people by telling them to leave the visitors alone and to fear the punishment of Allah. He even advised them seek sexual fulfillment with their wives because it is what Allah made lawful for them. Blinded by passion, they laughed at Prophet Lut. Seeing that Prophet Lut was helpless, one of the travelers informed Prophet Lut by saying, Do not be anxious or frightened, Lut for we are angels, and these people will not harm you. Then, Angel Jibril threw some dust at the men. It caused them to become blind. The angels warned Prophet Lut to leave the town before sunrise without turning back. Prophet Lut and his daughters left the town of Sodom and his wife was left behind. Allah had decreed that the town of Sodom should perish. Angel Jibril lifted the town of Sodom and raised it to the heavens. The town was literally flipped upside down. Everything and everybody was destroyed. This area is currently the Dead Sea. My advice to the Muslims that are reading this. The concept of hijab is not just for women. The hijab goes for both genders. It means modesty and shyness. Dress modestly inside and outside your houses. Be always aware of covering your aura in front of others. Shyness is one of the beautiful qualities a believer can have. It is extremely hard to find nowadays. We should always check ourselves and not let the shaitan trick you. Homosexuality is not a sickness. It is a disease of the heart and may Allah subhana wa ta'ala protect all of us from falling into the traps of shaitan. Amin. May Allah protect us from fitna of Dajjal. Thanks for watching.